fasting by day and praying by night, he was the king's star of good fortune, and the souls of the malevolent were under his control. Sharaz B. wished the king's reign to be just, and he guided him in righteous paths, so that Tamir's lived purified of all evil and the divine far, emanated from him. The king bound Araman by spells and sat on him, using him as a mount on which to tour the world. When the demons saw this, many of them gathered in groups and murmured against him, saying the crown and far were no longer his. But Tamir's learned of their sedition and attacked them, breaking their rebellion. He girded himself with God's glory and lifted his heavy mace to his shoulders, ready for battle. 